Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing an unboxing of the brand new FabFitFun Summer 2021 box. This one is always more exciting for me because it is right before my birthday so it's kind of like a little early birthday present to myself. I mean I've done a few unboxings here on my channel so you guys should know the drill with this box. But in case you're new, here are all the deets about it. So the FabFitFun box is four times a year. It is $49.99 per the box if you are a seasonal member. Finally remember to look that up beforehand <laughs> instead of making something up. And then there is the annual membership as well, which is the one that you pay for the entire year in advance. You save 20 bucks and it comes up to $179.99. So you save a little bit and then there are some other perks that come with that annual membership. I personally am an annual member. And then of course this box is a kind of lifestyle, beauty, all around kind of box. It doesn't really have one set kind of theme that each box is catered to and it's supposed to always come with eight items at least. Yeah, those are the deets here. Let's get the baby scissors out and slice into it. And here we go. All right, but there's of course the box. We got our magazine here, which they do every single time. It's got a list of the products, give you some details about that. It gives a couple articles here and there. So I personally always take a little look at it. Now, something that they did different this time around, normally they have the all members get to choose from like one to three items, annual members get to choose one to three items, and then lastly, there is a selection of Fafit Fun customizations where they customize a couple items for you, but this time around, if you were an annual member, you got to customize the entire Fafit Fun box, so I already know everything that is <laughs> inside of here, but I'm still gonna do it the normal way that I unbox the Fabric Fun because I think that is the best way to do it. I don't know. I, I like doing it this way and you guys seem to like it as well. So we're going to stick through going through all of the customizations for all members, then the annual members going through each choice that was available just because, uh, you know, it's fun. And uh, yeah, that's how we're going to be doing it today. So let's just get started with the first customization. This was all member choices. So the first four customizations were all member choices. So let's start with the very first one. This one actually had seven choices. It had quite a few. There was the Summer Fridays CC Me Serum. Second was the PMD Clean in Teal. Third, the Summer Salt Neoprene Beach Tote in pink slash red or blue slash green. Fourth, the Virginia Wolf Multi Wear Wrap. Fifth, the Society 6 Outdoor Blanket. Sixth, the Society 6 Wine Chiller. And seventh, the L Space Tie Dye Tote. How. And for me personally, out of all of those, I ended up going with the PMD Clean. Now, I know what you're thinking, like, haven't you gotten that in a few boxes now? And yes, yes I have. I've gotten probably like two others in like a Boxy Charm, Boxy Lux, or was it a Cause Box? I don't know. I've gotten two other ones and I decided to go for the third one because I've been handing them out to my family and um, they love them. They're going crazy over them. So <laughs> it's like, all right, someone else is going to get another one of these. Got a lot of family members. So yeah, I think these are really good and they honestly make a great gift. So that's why I got it. <laughs> Customization number two here. This one had eight choices. First up, we had the Draper James Ruffle Nighty. Second, the Way Detox Shampoo and Scalp Massager. Third, the Millie Jewelry Case. The fourth option was the OB Two Resistant Hip Bands and Two Month Obey Membership. Oh, okay, so you got a membership with them too. Fifth was the Ray Dunn by Magenta the Guac and Salsa Bowls. Sixth, we have the Sonics Bluetooth Speaker. Seventh, the Tarte Drink of H2O Hydrating Boost Moisturizer. And eighth was the Business and Pleasure Co. Cooler Bag. And personally, I decided to go for the Tarte. The Drink of H2O Hydrating Boost Moisturizer. I was in between this one and the Way, but I ended up deciding to go for the Tarte one just because I wanted to test out a little bit more of the Tarte skincare. Haven't tried that much of it. I've only gotten the Tarte Micellar Water one and uh, that's about it. <laughs> so I wanted to give it a shot and it did sound like it was good with the ingredients that I had in it. It has squalene, the hyaluronic acid, and they had an ingredient that made me like, hmm, 
It's uh, algae and it's supposed to help with wrinkles and smooth and soften the skin and lines and all that. So I was just like, okay, okay, let me, let me test that out a little bit. See what we're working with there. So yeah, that one intrigued me by the ingredients. Now for the third customization option. And this one again, we had eight choices. So the first was the Cork Cycle 12 ounce wine tumbler with silicone straw. Second, the Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen SPF 40. Third, the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Dry Shampoo. Fourth, the AG Hair Recoil Curl Activator. Fifth, the Poolside Water Resistant Pouch. Sixth, the Bubble Bar Build Your Own Bracelet Kit. Seventh, the Malin and Gotez Vitamin E Face Moisturizer. And then eighth was the Nectar Blue Light Blocking Glasses in Round Eye Brown Tortoise. And I went for the Living Proof the perfect hair day dry shampoo. I actually just finished up the living proof leave-in conditioner that we had gotten in another box. <laughs> Everything's for a box. Just finished it up, loved it. So I am totally on board for trying some more living proof. And I mean, you can never go wrong with a dry shampoo, I think. And then we got customization number four, which is the last of the all member choices. This one, there was only four choices. So the first was the Sensuals Vitamin C Facial Serum. The second was the Ciate London Watermelon Burst Setting Spray. Third was the African Botanics Shimmering Gold Oil. And fourth was the TF Publishing Brain Teasers and Activity Book Bundle. Games, puzzles, and more. And the one I chose was this one. The African Botanicals Shimmering Gold Oil. I'm just plopping a little bit here on my arm to use it to kind of help illuminate the body. I mean, it's summer season. We need a little of that. It's an interesting smell. It kind of just smells like baby oil, to be honest. Yeah, baby oil. That's, that's what it's given me. Can we see the difference? It's the one without the tattoo on it. That's got the shimmering body oil. Yeah, so I got a little bit of a shimmer here. It's just such an interesting fragrance. I mean, I know it's not baby oil. This has a lot more uh, ingredients. Baby oil is just mineral oil and fragrance. This one's got like tons of different oils in it. Main one is coconut oil, some melon seed oil, marula seed oil. I don't know what this one is, but baoba seed oil. It just has that kind of like combined fragrance that reminds me of baby oil. And this one's actually really expensive. This one is I think supposed to be a trial size because the full size is 3.4 ounce. This is two ounce. The full size is $105. So it's quite an expensive body oil, <laughs> very expensive body oil. But that was option number four. Let's move over to customization number five. There is actually only two more customizations left. These two were only for the annual members to choose from. There was less customization options this time around, but I do believe it's because the next couple of ones were all bundles, which we'll, we'll get into that in customization six. Customization five though, let's do that one first. So for this one, there were seven choices. Number one was the Mented Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in Blood Orange, Peachy Keen, or Blacker the Berry. Second was the Mind Tan Body Skin, the Recovery After Sun Gel. Third, the Sore Selfie Ring Light. Fourth, the Dr. Brandt Pores No More Purifying Cleanser. Fifth was the Flight Mode High Altitude Hydration Mask. Sixth, the To The Market Melamine Printed Tray. And seventh was the EPAR Cutting Boards Set of Four. The one I went with this time was the Mented Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick. And I ended up grabbing the shade Blacker the Berry. I just thought this looked like a very beautiful, rich shade, so I wanted to try it. And let me do just that. Let me wipe away my lip color, test it out. Ooh, that's a nice shade. Has really good even pigmentation going around on the lips too. So the color is really nice and solid. And it is completely like a liquid lipstick. This thing has dried down fully already. Like, <laughs> so just know that there is no give to this liquid. It, it's gonna dry fully down. So yeah, that was the fifth customization option. Now we're on to the sixth, which is actually the last one. And this one had a lot, a lot, a lot of different combinations. So this is gonna take a second. <laughs> 
let's begin. So the very first combination was the Aiko Double Act Shadow Stick and the Art and Cook Citrus Squeezer and the Aria Beauty Reusable Makeup Swabs. The second bundle was the Seraphine Botanicals Fruit Butter Lip Mask and the Art and Cook Citrus Squeezer and the Blush Pineapple Tray. Third bundle was the Aiko Double Act Shadow Stick and the Barefoot Scientist Pedicure File and the Aria Beauty Reusable Makeup Swabs. Fourth option and bundle was the Spongelly Body Wash Infused Buffer and Barefoot Scientist Pedicure File and the Blush Pineapple Tray. Fifth bundle option was the Seraphine Botanicals Fruit Butter Lip Mask and the Barefoot Scientist Pedicure File and the Blush Pineapple Tray. Sixth bundle, <laughs> this was the Kate Spade New York Workout Socks and the Butanique Beauty Eye Gels. Seventh bundle was the Skin & Co. Roma Truffle Therapy Whipped Cleansing Cream and the Erno Laszlo Pore Cleansing Clay Mask. Then the last four were just single items, no bundles here. There was the Verso Botanicals Super Eye Serum, the Ole Henriksen Fat Glow Facial Mask, that one's actually really good, the Lashes MD Eyelash Conditioner, and fourth, the Murad Rapid Collagen Infusion. So a ton of different options there. The one thing I did notice with that one is it did seem like a lot of repeating items that were bundled together with a lot of other repeating items. That's the one thing that I noticed with that one that had me a little bit like me. Because if you've been getting FabFitFun for a while, you may have gotten a lot of those items in the past. But uh, the one I ended up going with was one of the first bundles. <laughs> it was the one that had Spongelly Body Washed Infused Buffer, the Blush Pineapple Shaped Ice Mold, and the Barefoot Scientist Pedicure File. So let's take a quick look at these ones. Let's look at the tray first. And this one's just a ice pineapple tray. You get a giant shaped pineapple to make little shaped pineapple ice cubes. Then third, let's look at this guy. So the Spongelli. <laughs> I just want to say that when I see this. The Body Wash Infused Buffer. It looks like a giant flower. It's infused with tea blossom. It does smell good. You're supposed to cleanse, exfoliate, massage with the extracts of the Yuzu, Edelweiss, and Vetiver. And then the third product in that bundle that I got, this was the Barefoot Scientist Pedicure File. And it's got the flat side here, and then this side has got the little bumps in it that feel a little bit rougher. I think this is more so for like callousy side if you really wanna buff it out. This one may be more to smooth. Look like an interesting kind of tool, a little bit different than the normal like foot file that I have. So I thought I'd give it a shot. I do tend to have kind of rough feet and you know, summertime is when you wanna get them all nice and pretty. So we're breaking out the sandals sandal season. And that was officially the last customization option. We have an empty box here. And then let's see here if I can get a value for the box real fast. So because I'm not 100% sure about the African Botanics, that one was a deluxe size that they don't really sell. I'm guessing it's roughly around like 64-ish dollars. So I'm getting a value of $288.99 for this box. The one thing that did kind of stand out to me as being very expensive, aside from that one, was that pineapple ice tray. They say it's $11.99 and Walmart even sells it for $28. I'm looking at it like for an ice tray. Seems a little bit expensive. Like I would buy one of those for like maybe max $4. <laughs> if I saw that in store for $11.99, I would pass on it. But yeah, that was our entire FabFitFun box this time around for the summer 2021 version. And overall, I would say that I'm happy with the box. It did have a lot of good items inside of it, like a lot of kind of staple pieces that I'm looking at. Like, okay, I could get a lot of use out of that. But I don't know if it's just me, but I I feel like there's been other FabFitFun summer boxes that have just been a little bit more exciting than this. This one seemed a little bit on the safe side, especially with going with all of those bundles of the previous kind of like recycled items, if you will, since they've had them so many times before. It just felt a little bit kind of repetitive, I think, with some of the choices, you know? Cause that's the fun part with the subscription boxes is getting to try all the new products. You don't want to see the same stuff over and over again. So if you've been a consistent FabFitFun member, you know, it's going to be a lot of like the same stuff starting to repeat. So I'm just hoping that it's not going to be a continuing pattern here. Hopefully uh, the next couple boxes are a little bit more variety with new stuff. That's the only thing I really have to say about 
the summer one. But that is going to be it for today's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and hit that little bell button. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.